Hello, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Neverwinter Nights, Hordes of the Underdark. Alright, um, I have cleared my throat, <laughs> and we are ready to go ahead and explore the Isle of the Maker. So the first thing we're going to do, of course, is summon that creature. Huge Water Elemental. Cool. So we got something here, some kind of structure. What's this all about then? Huh. And this is a door. What does it say? The dungeon entrance. Well, let's explore the over, or sorry, the uh, above ground section of this area a little bit more before we go down into the dungeon. There's something down there. Oh, that's just uh, the harbor. A wise mage knows that when a spell is cast is almost as important as which spell is cast. Preparation is often the key to battle. Well, thank you for that advice. So, it doesn't look like they put a huge amount of effort into designing this area. It's kind of like smattering of things here and there. Doodads and such. But I think if this, once we clear out this section, we'll have cleared the map. Okay, so now we're ready to go down to the dungeon. Nothing of interest. Just a dungeon on an island. Come on, get down here, water elemental. Here we go. The upper ruins. Okay, so of course, uh, let me put ourselves into detect mode. Oh, and we also want to, oh dear. There we go, defensive casting. I want to have that ready. Um, oh, something to say? Okay. I agree. <laughs> yeah, let's have a existential dialogue with a golem. Deacon. A Durger rogue. Dead. Synthesty. Oh, there's the scavenger golem. Oh, we just want to talk. We just, we just want to talk. We want to have a philosophical dialogue. Oh, come on. Oh, no.
right? Stone roll me. Doesn't sound very tough. Okay, so we've killed these golems, but I assume the the other uh, the scavenger golem will be back and we'll bring them back to life. Uh, but first, let's get some buffs going here. Um, well, we have the opportunity. Yes, is there something you need? Oops. Group of the cast, the buffing spells on all the party members. And G can do the same. That will be good to have. So I didn't use defensive casting mode in that last battle because I didn't figure it was really worth um, casting. Okay, cool. So we got a door here. Let's check it out. Some more golems. looks important. Hmm. Okay. Sure. Let's continue on our way. We do a little save. Meter gone. Jumping Golem Minotaur. Lexicon Arcana. Okay, this is going to be important. This appears to be some kind of a dictionary for ancient arcane languages. I've decided to use the Unurakil language for special purpose golems. Alright, so we've got a key value store, basically. A map of nonsense words to English numbers. So this will be useful in a puzzle, no doubt. And another bookcase. Scriptures of the Created. Mithril statue combined with two parts of blue powder will yield a golem crasher. Okay. Combining golden rod with one part blue powder and one part yellow will give a golem binder. And a golem tractor is a magic crystal, one part blue powder, one part red powder. These three items will allow you to maintain control of your golems and prevent them from ever turning against you I'll cigard the maker. Okay, so there's gonna be some kind of crafting involved here to take care of these pesky regenerating golems. 
Oh, there's the mithril statue. Get some money. So I could make one of these. I could make one of these items, so I might as well, I guess. Uh, so what was it? It was two blue powders and the statue, I think. But I don't know how exactly we craft them. Israel statue combined with two parts of blue power will yield a golem crasher. Okay. A mithril statue. There it is. Drop, examine. You would need alchemist equipment to extract it, so we'll need to find the alchemist equipment before we can use this stuff. Oh, there's an Ethera. Maybe she was just invisible. Kill some more golems, I guess. Ooh, golden armor suit. Do you want to ask? Yes, is there something you need? No? Alright. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Ouch. That's what you get for casting haste. Jeez. Alright, no big deal. We'll take care of these guys in no time. these items again and grab this one whoa you eyes bugging out a little bit okay now let's do another save before we run into that room of death is hopefully not going to kill us this time. All right, so here we are. And as they run along, the faithful Cobalt companion wonder if Cobalt be delicacy to big dungeon monsters. Okay. some garbage over here a ring over here look at this did you find something maybe she was pointing to the garbage there's a rat nope there's a door over there Deacon, let's talk to Deacon. Deacon? 
I want you to identify my equipment. Ring of Spell Battle, Searing Helmet, Searing Armor, and Wanted Missiles. Okay. I was just wondering if there's any, like, uh, some kind of quest item that we need to worry about. Let's have at it! Yeah! 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 Oh, there's the alchemist apparatus. Nice. So with this, we should be able to make those items. Alright, well now... Do we do it? Okay, defensive casting mode activated. chest. Just some money and magic weapon scroll. Alright, um, so let's do a little save here. And then we'll go ahead and construct one of these items. Alright, so we needed to use the... Oh, that was what we got when we picked up the, um, suit of armor that was standing in the middle of that trap oh I see oh, I see right so we need this mithril statue and then two parts blue blue and we get the golem crasher and blue powder no I guess that's a bug when used against a construct, this item will send out a devastating ray that will damage the golem for 3 d 10 plus 30 damage, as well as knocking it to the ground for 1d4 rounds. Wow. That is, um, really strong. <laughs> I guess there's going to be some epic level golem that we're going to have to fight that will require something that ridiculously powerful to kill. Uh, okay, let's take this guy down. fighting. Something weird is going on here. The characters are sort of phasing in and out of existence. The guardian golem. Maybe we should use our item. Want to give it a try? You. Wow, it's strong. So that's why we got this thing. Oof. Use a potion here. Kill it dead. Go, go. Oh no. 
Oh no. Die! Oh boy. Okay. Die! Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Alright, sweet. Something down here. But I I don't know about this party member is not doing anything stuff. Follow attack oh, okay, so it's probably guard me. I give them it's probably my command that I gave them that was causing them to do that weirdness. And Deacon's too far away to give orders to. So if we go somewhere else and take a rest. That's probably going to bring all the golems back. Where is Deacon? He's still up here. Yeah, there you are. You need to guard me. Is he stuck? Deacon, are you stuck? I think he was probably stuck what, behind that summon. Alright. Not exactly inspiring confidence. Where the heck is Deacon? follow me? I think he's just totally glitched out. So what does this do? Hmm. Something. Are there like floor levers? No. Maybe that just like disarms the trap if you haven't disarmed it otherwise. Oh man, this guy's back. I hope the guardian golem is back. That would be bad news. Especially considering my party members are all bugged out and they won't do anything. Okay, so this guy isn't back.
Yeah, it's tough being a dragon. <laughs> nice. Well, should we finish exploring this area or should we carry on to the next area? Let's finish exploring this area. And we'll do the next area in the next video. The control room. Huh, that sounds important. Let's check it out. Some iron golems. Okay. Uh, let us cast... Let's have at it! Looks like Deacon is doing stuff, so that's good. Nashira, are you doing anything? Uh, she's just hanging out somewhere, I guess. in bad shape, so let's hear him up. Oh, come on. Oh, he's not he's not quite dead yet. Get it together, man. Okay. Are you kidding me? All right, so let's do another save. Got some control panels here, some boxes. 
chests, I should say. Some stuff of no particular value. Money is nice. Okay, let's take a look at this control panel. Uh, okay. That did something. Okay, that's obviously not enough. Oh. So this like increments numbers? Yep, that's what it does. So if we take a look at this book. Oh, he was saying something. That golem was saying something, and it was probably this number. Let's take a look. Synth, synth testy. All right. Let's take a look. Synth is five, and testy is four. Okay, fifty-four. Come on! Okay, so we took care of the scavenger golem, and it will not be resurrecting golems anymore, I don't think. Hey, how about that? I actually solved a puzzle. Um, Alright, so I think that is enough for this episode. We will continue on into the following area in the next episode and maybe finish up this dungeon, I guess, in the lower area. Um, we'll see. Uh, but until then, I will see you next time.